West Side Story is basically the dance movements lifted straight out of the Broadway production and some of the movements taken from the movie. That love story, that innocence, the loss of innocence, that's all still very relevant in the world today. There's a lot of jazz movement to it, but there's also a section where there's a balletic idea. It's called West Side Story Suite, because it's not, it's not technically the play, it's not the full thing where we do excerpts and bits and pieces from it. Well, and I think it's also the kind of thing that a lot of people have grown up on West Side Story and have seen it a million times, so we don't, we don't need to over-explain ourselves necessarily. <laughs> Peter Martins had asked Jerry a couple of times um, if he thought it would be possible for the company to do West Side Story. Jerome Robbins must have looked around the company and seen dancers and characters that he felt like could pull it off. Boy, boy, crazy boy, get cool boy. Yeah, I don't think there's any other time that we um, sing on stage. I mean, not, not as... Um, not yet, at least. I remember my first performance, and it was the craziest amount of like butterflies in my stomach. I've never sang before out on stage, and all of a sudden it's like cotton mouth dry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Did you get that? Yeah, I choked on I choked on um, it a little bit the first time. There is a really like, fun mix in West Side Story of a, like borderline classical choreography with very real, very pedestrian, you know, reactions and movements. The, Rumble's a perfect example of that. I mean, definitely not. I, mean, I don't know how many people fight and point their foot when they try to kick somebody. But, but then, you know, there are also other things in it, um, other aspects to it that have nothing to do with dance and nothing to do with ballet and only anything to do with the frustration and the anger of being in a knife fight with somebody. It's one of the really special things about New York City Ballet is the, you know, outrageously large range of repertory that we do. I get to have um, sneakers on one night playing riff, and then the next night I'm in um, something very purely classical. There are people that come up to me and they say they've seen the, the Broadway version, and that it makes them cry because they just, they remember that feeling, they remember being there that night, and it just brings back all these memories for them. 